Hydroponics is a very successful way of growing vegetables and other food crops. In fact, if you go into your supermarket, all the top-end vegetables are grown this way, like lettuces, capsicums, trussed tomatoes, pak choy, and even these gobstopping strawberries. How does it work? A nutrient solution is fed into the system where the plants grow in a media that has no soil. Plants take up the nutrient and grow. Nutrient which consists of refined, soluble minerals gets topped up regularly. Plants are grown from seed or cuttings in sterile rock wool called cultilene, then transferred into a pot or a grow bed into the growing medium. Alternatively, you can wash soil off seedlings' roots or sow seeds direct onto this expanded clay medium. There are many systems you can use to home grow food. And here at the demonstration farm in Canning Vale, they're all on show for you. Now there is no supermarket on planet Earth that can come close to this freshness test. Tomatoes grow magnificently in this shallow aqua flute tray in expanded clay. This is what the kit looks like. Capsicums have their own Dutch Barto pots. This system is called deep flow. These divine looking strawberries are growing in an NFT system where a film of nutrient in the solution just touches the bottom of the root system. A home size kit makes growing a breeze. Basil is thriving in a shallow tray. Nutrients are fed in from a small reservoir by a pond pump. How much pesto could you make with this lot? And how about this lettuce? 28 days from this to this in another NFT system. Ready to grow kits using all these different systems are available from the shop in Canning Vale and online, together with a wealth of advice. Or you can check out this website. My advice, start small and simple. Even use a watering can to apply the nutrients. Now a system like this, which is used for growing sprouts and microgreens, is a great example. So get used to this, get an understanding of how it works, and then work your way up to more sophisticated systems. You know, there's nothing quite like the satisfaction you get from growing your own food. Mm -hmm.